This video is for anybody who aspires to make millions of dollars on your e-com store, whether it be on Shopify, Wix, or any platform that you use. I'm going to share with you a little known secret that I have used and stumbled upon eight years ago when me and my best friend Gabe were starting our brand that has now done well over eight figures in sales. So for those of you who don't know who I am, my name is Timothy Dixon, AKA Ken Drippy Jr. Cause I stay fresh. You know what I'm saying? We got the hottest brand in the world, but I'm gonna tell y'all this. If you have a product that you de desire to scale, I'm twisting up my words today. If you have a product that you know is great and you want to be able to sell a lot of it, I'm going to give you a little known secret that's going to help you do that. So I'm going to jump into it this way. Me and my kids, they're 13 and 15. I was asking them, did they want to go see Inside Out 2 with me last night? And my son was telling me, he was like, man, that's a kid movie, dad. Why you want to go see that? And I was like, <clears throat> we got into this full discussion around Inside Out 2. And I was I was telling him, I was like, man, this movie is more than a kid's movie. It's about emotional intelligence. And I said, once you learn how to manage your emotions, it will help you give you good internal language on how to deal with things and not get mad and be triggered by everything that happens in your space. Longer conversation. First time in a while, my kids have really listened to me for 45 minutes at a time. And I told them, I was like, man, you know, people pay me, you know, 10, 20, $30,000 to teach this stuff, but that's another story. Um, so I want to explain to you um, how to position your product and frame it in a way that will help you sell a ton of it. Uh, a great product alone will not sell itself. You have to understand how to sell. So the way I stumbled up on this is it was like, for me, it was a natural thing that I didn't quite understand when our business started to take off. But I would get on calls with people and do Zooms and help them build and scale their businesses. And then Gabe and I formed a company called Entre Believer, which thank you for tuning into the channel. Hit that subscribe button. And Entre Believer and our clients, we have a ton of clients who are doing hundreds of thousands of dollars a month. And some of them are doing millions of dollars of sales every single year. And it's all through uh, one of these this is a small principle, a part of uh, a framework and a system that we teach that helps people scale. So if you understand this thing that I'm about to show you, it will help you grow your business. So as me and my kids are talking about this movie and we're talking about communication, I pulled out the trusty headphones with the strings on them. And I said, hey, in 2016, Apple launched these, right? If you were walking down the street, I gave him this example. If you were walking down the street and somebody had these in their ear and you stopped in front of them and you said, hey, I got this product, I'll sell you for 150 bucks. The first thing that they're gonna say is, well, what is it? Or they're gonna like avoid you and keep walking by you because you're a stranger and you're not presenting the product in such a way that makes me understand why they need this product, right? And so here's what should happen. Here's what people, that's what 95% of brands do online. 95% of brands are presenting their product like somebody walking up to them with a great idea, but not giving them the context of what it is. So you have to be able to show them problem solution. Hey, would you, are you tired of having headphones that's connected to your phone and everywhere you go, you got this string hanging up around you? Wouldn't you like to have some earphones that are wireless that you can answer with the tap of a button that you can sit your phone down or you can run or you can work out and exercise and not have these strings connected to your ear? If you can present that in 15 to 25 seconds in such a way that gets people to stop you can build a multi-million dollar business. Now, this is part of a framework that we've been teaching for years. Like I said, we've done over $20 million in sales. We've done eight figures with our brand, acquired another couple of brands, and both of those brands have done over a million dollars. And we have a Shopify portfolio of brands that have scaled and grown. So I'm gonna jump over to the computer and I'm gonna show you guys on screen a particular video 
that has helped us make, sell over 1,500 items with this one video. So let's jump into it and talk through it. And I hope that this helps you understand how to frame your products and how to scale and grow. Let's jump into it. All right, so before we jump into one of our products, I wanna show you something involving these headphones we're just talking about, right? The Apple uh, earbuds. So this is a billion dollar product, right? So let me show you how just capturing a small percentage of that market can still lead to a multi-million dollar business. So if, if Apple is making billions of dollars every single year, you can have a viable, successful business, drive the nicest cars, have the nicest home, just by creating a product that cuts into that market share. So the same way we talked about these headphones, this being an improvement up on these, let me show you a company that's making a mark and making a decent amount of money selling a product that competes with the earbuds. As long as you understand problem solution and being able to explain it, let's get into this video and let me break it down for you. Are you still listening on these? The status between 3 A and C was designed to be the most advanced wireless earbud on the market. Now sure, that's some fancy marketing terms, but what does that actually mean? Well, it means all the standard stuff, like industry-leading active noise canceling and a smart transparency mode. It means industry-leading battery life with nearly two days worth of continuous playback. The earbuds have six independent microphones for amazing call quality. But beyond all of that, the Between 3 A and C has something incredibly special, and that is a hybrid triple driver speaker system. You have one 10 millimeter dynamic driver exclusively for bass. Then you have two balanced armatures for the mid-range and the treble. Now balanced armatures are specialty speakers used in hearing aids for the recreation of fine detail. The result is a wide three-dimensional audio signal unlike anything you've heard from a standard earbud. So if you'd like to try an earbud with award-winning sound quality, industry-leading active noise canceling, and quite frankly sounds like nothing you've experienced before, give the status between three a and C a shot. Now, what I want to say to this is, I want you to look at some of the contents on this. Just received mine. They're just awesome earbuds, better than Barrows and Wilkins. Best I've had, and I've tried many. And so they have thousands of people confirming that their product is super dope. So when you think about it, you can improve up on any product. I don't care if it's been around for a hundred years or a thousand years or just, you know, six months. If you can improve up on a product and you learn how to create content that works with human buying behavior, then you will be able to sell a ton of that product, right? We've done it with multiple uh, items, multiple pieces and concepts, and we consistently do millions of dollars a year. Now it's unheard of that a brand uh, like ours has been around for eight years and we consistently do hundreds of thousands of dollars a month. Now, most brands die very quickly. 95% of brands die uh, without ever making a profit. Most entrepreneurs never have a business that make a million dollars in revenue over a year, let alone make the owners and founders uh, millionaires in the process. So if you want to be a millionaire and you want to be able to uh, get your product in front of the right people, then you have to learn human sales psychology. And there's so much in this video. Like I would encourage you to rewind it back and look at how um, I broke this entire video down over an hour with my students. I don't have that much time, but uh, the way they go from here's the problem, here's the solution, here's the benefit in our product, over 47 seconds. You can accomplish this in under 60 seconds. For us, we like to keep it to 15 to 21 seconds with our videos, but I'm gonna show you one of ours and I'm gonna break it down a bit on how we've been able to uh, sell thousands of this product um, just off of this. It's one of our basic uh, sweatshirts. So let's, let's talk through it. Sometimes the business in life can keep us from doing the one thing that is really important in our walk, and that is prayer. One of my favorite things about this collection is that it is a constant reminder that prayer is a necessity. It is not something that we should just do in response to things going on in our life. It should be a way that we continually grow in fellowship and relationship with our Father. 
Now, for our avatar, which is the person we know uh, desires to buy things from us and the people we know that we solve a problem for, when you start a video that sometimes uh, life gets busy, busy and we forget to pray, and then the very next thing after the hook is a video breaking down why we created this product and why it solves that problem for you and encourages you and reminds you to do something that you desire to do in your life every day. This is a recipe for creating a frenzy around a product. And so, like I said, we sold thousands of these sweatshirts is a very basic um, product with a small, unique uh, selling point. And uh, unique selling points is something I'll get into uh, in a video, uh, in a training soon. But yeah, like once you understand hum what humans think when they want to buy things and you understand sales psychology, it is a way for you to print money. And like I said, problem solution. So ask yourself, what problem does your brand solve? What problem does the product you want to sell to people solve? And if you understand what problems it solves and you understand who it solves it for, then you can clearly communicate it to the buyer, right? Clear messages, scale brands. People do not buy what they do not understand. And if you cannot explain it well to them, then, hey, it, it's amazing to me that people spend so much money investing in the product only for it to sit in their garage or only to have a a uh, print on demand store that has 150 products on it and they may sell one product every three months. Like it doesn't have to be that way, but so many people spend money on the product, but nobody spends money investing in their growth, whether it be time, whether it be money, whether it be uh, getting in the right community, like literally changes my life. I've taken over $50,000. I've spent over $50,000 on courses in the last year. I've spent $16,000, uh, to work with one person and I do millions of dollars in sales. I'm going to say it like Myron Golden says, he says, it's interesting to me that, um, the people who need what you have the most are the least likely person that's looking for it. And a lot of the reasons why is because they have bad internal language and a bad thought process behind uh, what they think they need and what they actually need. And so there's a there's a gap in the bridge between what they know and what they think they know, and they just don't get it. And so uh, rich people understand that I want the fastest way to the growth, right? I don't want to make a million dollars in 12 months. I want to make a million dollars in a month. I want to, I literally want to shrink the gap between how fast I can make money. And that doesn't come by trying to make money. It comes by understanding uh, what problems you solve. And the bigger the problem you solve, the more uh, money you can make. Or the better you can explain the problem and your product being the solution, the more money you will make. So literally the serving is selling. So uh, get into community, understand sales psychology and learn these things. This is just like very surface foundation. Uh, but the deeper you go into understanding these things that I'm talking about, the more money you can make. So anyway, uh, if this has given you any value, make sure you subscribe to the channel, share this with other people. We want to see you grow and scale uh, your brand and we want to help make more e-com millionaires, right? So we love y'all. Entrepreneur, keep building. Let's go.